when Abby was telling me about this boyfriend, I thought, okay, we'll see how long this kid sticks around. And a year goes by, and another year, and another year, and I was like, this kid is not, he's like a barnacle on the boat, and I'm just scraping him off. At that point, I was like, all right, I'll, I'll get to know him. I'll see what Abby sees in this person. And how did I know that that was someone that Abby deserved to be with? And I very quickly realized, Ryan is in love with Abby. The man that Abby was going to marry needed to make her feel the way she makes everybody else feel. Special and important, and like their life is better just by being in it. You look beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Love, Love you, baby. If you know Ryan, you know that he is. He is thoughtful and he is kind. People like to make jokes about Ryan and Abby, and I remember them so dearly that people would be like, how did Ryan get Abby? And he is so lucky. And I'll never forget the day that Abby looked at me and she said, I hate when people say that. Because I am the lucky one. So for Abby and Ryan, for all of the great and wonderful days I know that you will have. I hope that you still look at each other and you still think I am the lucky one. And you still think that my life is better because this person is in it. So I want to raise a toast to Abby and Ryan. The lucky ones. Dearly loved friends and family of Ryan and Abby, welcome to this wonderful celebration. And that's what we're here to do today, to celebrate this union between this man and this woman. As a parent, is this not the pinnacle of what you want? It is the absolute reason you spend all your years with your kids to be moral, productive, and God-fearing. And to find a spouse that will make their life complete. Hi Ryan, take you Abigail. To be my wedded wife. To be my wedded wife. Hi Abigail, take you Ryan. Hi Abigail, take you Ryan. To be my wedded husband. To be my wedded husband. Everybody that knows Ryan knows this, is that he is the goofiest guy that is always ready to put a smile on your face. He's dependable, um, he's loyal, he's stubborn, <laughs> and has the biggest heart. I asked Ryan where he thought things were going with Abby. He looked me in the eye and without hesitation said, I'm going to marry that girl. And once he sets his mind to something, he's going to do it. Now by the authority committed to me as a minister of the gospel of Jesus Christ, I pronounce you, Ryan and Abigail, husband and wife. It is now my privilege to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Ryan Jackson Kruger. So happy for you and so pleased that you're part of the family. We love you guys. Uh -huh. 